Hello, so in this video I test out some distillation equipment I made. So here I'm distilling vinegar, but you can really use it to distill whatever you want. Hello, so today we're going to try distilling white vinegar. So I've got set up here so the burner will heat the vinegar. The vapor will go through this tube, through this condenser, and condense in this test tube in this measuring cup full of ice water. So fill it up with about 50 milliliters of vinegar. solution to heat up. Okay, so now the vinegar is boiling and the vinegar vapor is rising up through this pipe, through this tube, then into this condenser area, which is a plastic tube, and will then goes into this cooled test tube right here, where it condenses into water, and you can see it forming on the sides there. So about 10 milliliters of the vinegar has boiled away so far, it looks like. And this is really hot, like, it'll burn you if you touch it for too long. And as you can see where the ice touches the test tube, it's cleanly melted. Because this test tube is really hot, pretty hot too. And as you can see, a noticeable amount has evaporated. And we should be collecting some in this test tube here. Yep, see the test tube is filling up. The water level is right about here. So our distillation is almost done. And what's really weird is this test tube down here, even though it's in ice water, it's really hot. So if you reach down to ice water and touch it, it's really weird because your finger is feeling hot and cold at the same time. So here, roughly half of the vinegar has distilled and condensed down here, and that's about what I want, so I'm going to snuff this flame and let every, everything cool down. Okay, so everything has cooled sufficiently, so I can go ahead and take it apart. Okay, so everything's cooled down, and I'm disassembling it, and now we're going to find out what our results are. Okay, so, here's the test tube of distilled liquid. As you can see, it's actually slightly yellow colored. I'm not quite sure why that is. But now let's test the pH. Okay, so here's our tube distilled liquid. And we're going to find out what the pH is. Pour a little bit in a cup. and test it with some pH paper. Now it looks like the liquid is still slightly acidic. Okay, so now we're going to test the pH of the solution that that we evaporated. There's still a little bit left because I didn't distill all the way, so let's test it. Okay, so here we have the solution that was being distilled, and here we have the distillate, so let's compare them. So as you can see, they're almost the same, because the active ingredient in the vinegar, acetic acid, also was vaporized and managed to pass through, which is pretty unusual, but as you can see, the lighter one, which is the, which is the distillate, since it's lighter red, that means it's less acidic, so... It kind of worked. Okay, so this was pretty cool, but don't miss the next video because we still have to test the result and find out how much different it's from regular vinegar. Thanks for watching. See you next time. So if you like this video, please like and subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.